Hi everybody, Steve and Lisa Stone from Ray White and Parnell here. And this week we are talking about... Final inspections. So if you've bought a property and you've gone, someone said to you, have you had a final inspection? You may wonder what that is. What it is, is it's your final chance to have a look through the property before you actually take possession of it. So quite often your, so your solicitor will say, are you happy for the transfer to go through? And you say, yes, I bought the property, I'm happy with how it is. So, yep. what so typically final inspection will happen a couple of days, like the day or two days before you settle. So you've, you know, as close to settlement as possible. Um, I think some of the important things that you need to check is that um, it is as it was last inspected. So the last time you were at the auction or the last open home that you went to. Yep. It means no extra holes in the wall, no broken windows, those sorts of things. And just be careful too, I know it sounds a bit paranoid, but if there's a hole in the carpet, and they've had a rug over it, unless you can prove that that hole in the carpet wasn't there when you came through the open home, then I'm afraid you're stuck with it. So, I mean, number one is, as we always say, get a building inspection, because they'll pick up stuff that may need to be fixed before you end up owning the house. Mm, absolutely. Um, and key thing to remember too is that chattels, unless they've been excluded from the sale, so sometimes we might say exclude a dishwasher because it's not working and it's very clear mm. in the sale and purchase agreement, everything should be working. So the gas hobs, the oven, all of those sorts of things, you get to check those and make sure that they are working. So you ring the agent, you say, you know, a week before settlement and you say, like to do a final inspection, you go around, check all the lights, check the dishwasher, check that the oven's working, all of that sort of stuff, make sure it's all up to scratch as you would have last expected it, inspected it. The only thing to watch out for is, funnily enough, New Zealand law doesn't, and as part of the settlement, doesn't mean that the property has to be clean or tidy. Nope. So, you know, sometimes people go, oh, they haven't even cleaned out the cupboards. Tough, I'm afraid. That's just the way it is. If they haven't cleaned them, you're stuck with it. Most of our clients, of course, our lucky clients, would always clean up Absolutely. before they leave. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. So be careful about that. If you've got any questions about final inspections or anything else, drop us an email or give us a call because we'd love to have a chat and we'd love to help.